Madison County residents deal with snow covered roads and several inches packed from snow overnight. The weather leading to outages for more than 400 homeowners a county over in Yancey. The Spruce Pond United Methodist Church allows us to use their facility here. In Mitchell County, Megan Hicks with the Beacon Center takes us in the closet. We have our storage room back here. We have um, privacy panels that we set up. She wants to get word out. And then we have uh, lots of these cots that we set up. Megan and staff ready to go with cots with wind chills making it feel like single digits outside. Yeah. We are a temporary warm and shelter. So we provide a warm place for someone to sleep um, and that can be anyone that's in need. Laura Payne in Madison County has firewood ready to bring in and use in her wood burning stove. Yeah, we have a vent next to uh, next to the stove and it goes upstairs so it heats our entire house. I always describe it as a warm hug. As for the chilly forecast. For us, it really doesn't change anything. We, we make sure we have wood on hand every year um, before the winter kicks in. So it's like something that we do every year. It has been very busy. At the Marshall General Store, Aaliyah Chandler's been helping customers with oil. They're bringing in multiple, multiple propane tanks to be filled because they know what's coming. <laughs> For bovines with fur, they seem to be keeping warm despite the temperatures.